No, I mean, just a, a gutsy win. I uh, thought our guys, uh, after a pretty, you know, bad first half, you know, we regrouped, um, had a pretty good end to the, the first half. And I think that carried over in the second half. We really started to, to defend. I thought we were really soft in a lot of areas in the in the first half, but we really came out and competed. Um, you know, really got 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 some bodies. Got took guys took the individual challenge to guard, and I think that was the difference in the game. Robbie, uh, yeah, we were talking to Jordan, and, and he said that you impressed upon them. You know, the importance of this game. Uh, how big is it to come out with a win in this particular spot? No, I mean, it's just one of the games that we needed to win. I mean, we knew this was a dangerous team. Um, and even on their, their record, um, it hadn't been good. They've been in every game, you know, watching all of the, you know, the scouts for, for this game. They, they've done a lot of good things. There's some things that hadn't gone right for them um, at, the, at the end of the game. So we were, we were aware, was conscious of, of who they were. But, uh, you know, it's just, just one of those moments in the season. I know it's still early. And, you know, we're still missing some pieces, but it was one of those, I think, one of those games where it really was a, you know, early decider of what kind of season we was going to have. You know, and I think that I just tried to press that upon them. They're like, man, that's, you know, this, this is a game that, you know, we we should win. We should go in, go in and win. And it's a great game to give us some confidence, you know, with Tennessee coming back, um, you know, at home and in our place on Tuesday. Um, obviously, they... Uh, you know, had a, had a tough out in the day, so they're going to be looking for some get back. But you know, hopefully, this gives us some some, some confidence to, to come in and, and protect our home court. Aria, um, what did you see from Scotty at the end of the game tonight? You know, with getting that steal and just you know making his free throws. Um, you know, all that kind of. No, I mean, it's just, it just shows his will to win. I mean, Scotty wanted to win the game. He did a lot of little things. You know, stepping up there and making key free throws. Uh, you know, but I just thought it was just a number of contributions, you know, that, that for, for this game. Um, I thought, uh, you know, I thought Jermaine Mann was big for us, you know, being able to punch it inside to him, um, get some easy basket and, and Q-Dog. I mean, Q-Dog was unbelievable, you know, on both ends of the floor. Um, you know, when he got his opportunities in the paint, he turned and scored for us. Um, he was a big present force on the defensive end, you know, you know, clogging it up, you know, getting his hands, some block shots there. They're late, but you know, just uh, a lot of things. Trey came in and made made a couple of big shots for us. Uh, but you know, Jordan, you know, it was great for Jordan. Jordan to get his you know, his mojo back a little bit. You know, he, you know, been been chronicled a little bit. You know, his struggles over the last you know week or two, and um, I think you know him coming out and having a game like that really is it great for you know his confidence and great for our team confidence. I mean, he's a guy that we rely on to. Uh, as a big part of what we're doing on both ends of the floor, and I thought that was not only on the the, the offensive end, but he, he took the challenge against um, Glendo, who has been playing lights out um, in, in the SEC play. And, and I thought he, he, he did a great job in that area as well. Robbie? Uh, yeah, I, like you said, I feel like we've asked you a million questions about, about Jordan's slump. Uh, what, what did he do better today? Um, I mean, I thought he let the game come to him a little bit. Um, you know, just... Uh, didn't, I mean, we, we needed him to, to step up and, and make some shots. I mean, we had some really, really great looks. I mean, we can get those type of looks that we had in the first half, you know, all season long. I, I think, you know, good things will happen for us. I mean, we got guys that, you know, Gabe was just getting back. He, I thought he had four great looks uh, that, you know, I think over time, you know, once he gets his legs back under those be shots that he could step up and make. Um, but, but everybody, I just thought Jordan, he just played the game. He did it on the defensive end. He let the defense fuel his, his offense and then once he got a little confidence he saw it saw it go through um, a little bit you know so basketball is a game of confidence and uh, I think hopefully he can just maintain this confidence and um, stay in that frame of mind start with defense and then offense because he's not a guy that you really have to call a lot of things for you know I think his you know he has ability that that, that first rebound that he had I thought that that was probably really what get, got him going he got he had a huge offensive rebound and when you bring that I think that let me know that he was going, going to be assertive and, and focused this game and I think that's um, that's what that's what we need from him. Aria? You know Quentin um you got in foul trouble a little bit in the first half but in the second half he really you know stayed stayed out of foul trouble and you know was really key what was kind of the difference for him in terms of you know being able to stay in the game? 
Well, no, I mean, it's just, it's, it happens like that. When you play hard, I mean, it had a couple you know, touch fouls that, that, that he got that, that went against him early on. Uh, I think one of them he might have earned, and then the, the other one was just kind of, you know, one of those bang-bang plays on a, on a rebound that he got called for. And, uh, it changes the game for us when, 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 when he's out of there. But um, to, to Terran Frank's credit, you know, he came in and gave us, even they didn't play a ton of minutes, he came in, was really solid for us. They got an offensive rebound. Um, got you know he you know guarded well in the post. Uh, the, the score really wasn't on on him when they turned and scored in the post. Our low man didn't come in time, so he did his job and and gave us some some, some good minutes. You know while we were trying to buy some time to to get get Q back in, I I rolled the dice a little bit, you know, and, and let him play with two. But I know he's really smart and he's um, and, and and he wouldn't pick up that third one. So you know, our older guys, I, I can trust like that a little bit more. Him and Jordan and. Um, and, and Scotty, you know, think when they get those two fouls and we need a, you know, a possession maybe on offense where we want to still use them, they're smart enough to not not put themselves in, in harm's way. Yeah, Jordan, I mean, I, I, you know, obviously you've been in a slump recently, but um, tonight that, you know, was not, not the case at all. And, and you kind of powered your team to victory. Uh, what, you know, what was different tonight? What did you adjust or, or is it just a matter of jump shots going in? Uh, I think my, my teammates, really, they just kept picking me up the whole time. I missed those first two threes. And Scott was like, keep shooting, keep shooting, keep shooting. And every time I went to the bench, coaches and everybody just kept up, uplifting me. So once I saw that first one go down, it was just it felt good. Uh, how, how badly did you guys need this one with, you know, another tough game coming up? And every every game in the SEC is is super tough. And, you know, the two close lo- or the two losses coming into this one. Oh, definitely. This is a big uh, – coach said, said yes, so he didn't want to say it was a must-win game, but it was a really, really important game for us. And I think uh, we kind of took that um, took that and ran with it for this game. Um, we know that we, we, we gave one away against South Carolina. We had a bad game against Kentucky. So it's coming out tonight. We know we had to come out and play hard. Uh, had, well, this is a must-win game for us. Uh, what you know? What do you think changed for the team in general uh, coming out of the locker room from halftime? Uh, you guys had a 21-4 to run to start the second half. I think it's just the energy. Uh, we came out, we were aggressive on defense. Everyone was talking, everyone was engaged. Uh, and once we came out, we got a couple early buckets and, and we could the flow of the game kind of momentum kind of just shifted our way and we just took off with it. 